All right, guys, I don't have my full setup and apparently I left an important component behind. So uh, I don't even know if I'm gonna upload this, but I wanna at least record for kill tracking. I don't see a lot of threats to wheezing here. I'm gonna need to remove the Hitmonlee pretty early. So that is a fast hit moment then. Attack on hit moment. Okay. And protect on Marowak. Okay, that well, that's not too bad. Um, uh, we're definitely going to switch into Weezing here. And... We just go for an earthquake? I'm gonna target into the Marowak. Coaching hit on me. Yeah. Okay, so we definitely need to remove this Marowak. That was a crit. Three hits. That's not too bad. Stone Edge into Weezing. Not great, but we take it. Um, what's to stop us? What's to stop us from doing another? Uh huh. So he protects the Marowak. High jump kick into Haxorus. 
which we live, no problem with the focus sash. And then Weezing gets a bunch of health back. So now, what I want to do is preserve the Haxorus, target into the Hitmonlee, Okay. Well, that's fine. Hmm. Okay, so we remove the Hitmonlee. No, we don't. It took that really well. Marowak protects. It only goes down. So we've seen earthquake protect, brick break, and Stone Edge on the Marowak.
We encourage and avoid, but we take out the Marowak. And we get a good pain split off. Dragon Pulse from Hydreigon does not very much. And again, Rising Voltage is just not going to do enough. So, I think at this point, we can pretty safely just double into the Pinkurchin and call that a, a game one win. That's interesting. Denying me the kill. Okay, well, um, game one went well. So the question is, is there anything we want to change up for game two? Um, I'm thinking the same four, but I kind of want to lead the wheezing this time. Let's let's make him prove he can beat this same four. And if he goes for the same start, we'll we'll be able to punish a passive opening. Angle at War Beetle. So this looks like his trick room mode. So, Okay. Okay. 
he's going to get Trick Room off here. Um, we don't really have a good way to stop it. But we can at least reduce Orbeetle's offensive output once Trick Room is up with a Snarl. Um, Good damage there. We're sending in Weezing to stall out the Trick Room. We don't... Um, we can... We can win this without Weezing if we need to. Um, ooh, and we got the burn on Marowak. That's very fortunate for us. Um... turns left. Um, Thunderwave into the wheezing is actually going to make us slower. allow us to KO the Marowak before it moves this turn. So we don't mind that at all. Because he really doesn't have any way to deal with Frostmoth at this point. So we can just He mementoed himself. That's interesting. All right, well, Frostmoth doing work. <laughs> 